my favorite song on the album, I think, or at least uh, the one that that I was unsure of at first because it's it's slightly different. But when I sent it to you, I was like, yeah, this, I think this is really good. And then you sent me back the uh, the vocal lines for the, the verses and stuff, and I was like, fuck yes, there we go. That sort of like just a perfect perfect uh, version of this song. I really, really like this one. It's kind of a high-pitched uh, vocal. Kind of. Somehow. Yeah, yes. <laughs> but it, uh, it's one of those it, it's one of those songs that, you know, it's kind of a cliche to say you know, it wrote itself, comes from the melodies. I don't think I worked that long. Of course, I worked mm. hard, but maybe not that long with this, because it just came. It mm. came to me. And I think that is the, the, what's good with music, that sometimes just comes to you. You can hear, ah, I know exactly how Oscar is thinking, and I think this will work perfectly well to what he, you know, his his vision. Yeah, it, it, this also features a guitar solo that I'm particularly proud of. Uh, it's one, I spent a lot of time working on this solo. Not, uh, like you said, not a, a lot of time, but maybe a bit hard. I worked hard mm -hmm. on it uh, for an hour or two and just played it and played it and played it and I, I, I'm really happy with how that turned out, this, this one. There are a couple other solos I'm really happy with too, but this one was uh, just, yeah, it just complemented the song better than, than, than I would have imagined. And lyrically, probably one of my proudest moments as a lyricist, at least on this album. I mean, it's, uh, it deals with the, the fact that we die twice. First mm -hmm. time, when the heart stops, we stop breathing. The second time, and someone says your name for the last time. You gave me goosebumps. Me too. <laughs> <laughs>